Oh, I expect a, an apology from you, Dingo, and you better make it good. Fair enough. No surprise he's still angry. I messed up. I'm sorry. I never should have run away and abandoned you out there after the crash. What are you talking about? I'm talking about my pizza. It's time for you to apologize for eating my pizza without asking. Huh? You're mad about pizza? This is what I get for being so sincere. That was a great interaction. There's probably a lot more that they wrote that I just will never see. Let's let's do it. Louie, we brought you the final boss from Pikmin 1. Are you going to tell us to go kill the bo final boss of Pikmin 2? Because it's not in this game. You're going to have this. An extra hand. What? What? A sovereign bull blacks feast for supper. It's going to be a good night. Is that everything? I like this planet. I want to show it to Nana someday. I think that might be everything. I think we just did the quest. President, what's his name? We don't know. I really want to stay here. Hmm, space food. It's not enough. Okay, extra hand. What is this extra hand business? Uh, gear and skills. Extra hand. I hear you only- What? <laughs> I hear you can only carry the same amount as a single Pikmin. There's absolutely no shame in giving science a noble purpose. Really? Really? That's a first? Go punch that. And then... Watch this. Oh my word. That's... That's wild. And honestly, I think that's exactly what the short... The reward should be. Because if it was good, what on earth... We're done with the game. That's, you know, that's curtains, you know? It's like the the unlimited running for Ochi. It's like, why do we get this? Although, doing the quest with that made it in, uh, in a much better. Infinitely better. That is so funny. And something that, you know, every Pikmin player who grew up with this game has always wondered. Why don't the captains just help? What's so special about the Pikmin? And I would be fine if captains could help. I... I think that that would be a neat thing to do. If it was this week and it wasn't good at all, and it's just like, hey, you're one off, might as well. Why not? I can carry golden raw material. Fair point. Um, it's not very fast. In fact, it looks like it's slower than any single Pikmin. Maybe a, a, a purple... You know what? We're going to test this. We're going to test this. Although I probably don't have a purple leaf Pikmin. Yeah, it's going to be a flower starting out, but that's fine. We can compare that. Oh, it's so much faster than me as a captain. Wow. Like, maybe, maybe a purple leaf is as slow. Because this is um, insanely slow. Can I help a Pikmin carry it too? Well, why don't we test? Use the Plunkophone, which I constantly forgot that I had once I got it. Uh, okay, so I need those over there. Wah! 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 Dude! What? <laughs> Did I just... Is that how that's supposed to work? Is that how that's supposed to work? <laughs> ah! <laughs> that is not, I don't think, how that's supposed to, to work. Uh, and I also wonder if you had that at the beginning of the game if that doesn't open up a lot of speedrunning tricks. Like, I, I went eight feet off the ground there. I wonder if that, there's abuse there. Like, going places where the, the pink Pikmin can go, but you can't. Huh. That's, uh... <laughs> that might be the best reward of all. We ended off on a glitch? I don't even know what to call that. That just seems very broken. Um, thank you in, <laughs> in chat 
for uh, prompting me to try that because that's that moment was honestly is just as good as the reward. Pikmin 4. The chat is freaking out about it. So the captains do have a jump button. You just zip up. Now that has some out of bounce potential. <laughs> Pikmin 4 did... Uh, I, I'm not going to share my entire thoughts on this game because I've really done that in full already. But it did a lot of stuff that we've been wanting to see from Pikmin. Uh, white and purple onions... Um, <clears throat> rescuing a bunch of castaways was cool. Getting treasure back was sweet. Having Louie back was frightening. It, the mechanics of the game are... It, they got a lot of right with this game. But they also got a lot wrong. And I would say they got the most wrong out of, like, an objective standpoint of the game. Why is it that we can only take out three different kinds of Pikmin? That makes no sense. Uh... And, but it's like, it's such a huge step forward, but in the step forward, the game kind of breaks its ankle. So, with that said, it's still a massive leap forward. There's a lot of cool stuff in this game. I get, I would give this game like an 8 out of 10. And it just held back by a couple things, but once you get used to those things, for the most part, it's fine. It still has some of that Pikmin jank. And a lot of stuff where the lack of a C-Stick really holds the game back. Pikmin will, it seems, is destined to have a cursed set of controls. But, despite all that... Honestly, I think it stands shoulder to shoulder with every other game in the franchise. It's just a franchise that is has yet to get done 100% right. But that also gives it hope, because I still... Think I still hold these games in incredibly high esteem. I think that that oh that's another good point the chat's pointing out. Why on earth is there more Flarlic in the game than you can hold Pikmin? Part of it is like the Korok Seed dilemma of Breath of the Wild, and I don't know about Tears of the Kingdom, where it's like we're gonna put uh you need to get Korok Seeds to expand your inventory once you have 450, which is half of them. Um, then you're good. You don't need to get any more. So part of it is that. They really want you to hit the cap. But are you really telling me that it's impossible for us to have more Pikmin and that the game will, cr the system will crash? Are you really telling me that this isn't that much more powerful than the GameCube and the best it can do is, like, much better graphics? Undoubtedly, it is po more, it was powerful enough to load some extra Pikmin. And that's kind of my challenge for the next Pikmin game. What I want to see is I want to see a finale where they say, all right, you have 500 Pikmin, go. It's like it's like the finale of a Splatoon game where it's like they take off all, they make you super overpowered or fire crazy beams or um, give you crazy stats. Like, let's make this thing crazy. There are a lot of ways that this franchise can still go. And that's to its benefit. The fact that they're only scratching the surface and... The scratches are... I can't... I, I'm running out of uh, ways to push this metaphor. The fact that they've done so many cool things with the, with these games, and yet you can think of so many cooler things that they could still do, like I've talked about with the survival-based Pikmin game, where it's like you, four captains scattered in one giant, giant wilderness, the sum of every map and Pikmin combined. Uh, they have to worry about the the biggest boss of the, uh, in the, the woods coming to to eat them if they make if they make too many splashes um, and they have to survive the night or try to camp but going through the night can give them more progress that's such a cool idea if I do say so myself it's my idea uh, that I think that if that's just my idea I can only imagine what the all of the fans could come up with and what the designers can come up with considering this is already a far cry from every Pikmin game and it's really cool if you want to play a Pikmin game that feels like it really has it all, this is the one. And I would say that I thoroughly enjoyed every moment of this game, except for the moments where I didn't. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys 
in the next Pikmin LP or the other videos I make on the channel. I'm also streaming now, as it's obvious from, you know, me being on screen. Uh, I'm also streaming now, so check me out whenever I start streaming regularly. But, I still have yet to do Pikmin 3, and it's weird that I'm going to be doing it last. I have some strong opinions about that game too, but I also love it. So, one day, you'll see me back piloting Pikmin in Pikmin 3. I think that's all I got. Chat, you got anything? Boing. Say goodbye, chat. It's a little off the bottom. What? Why is it happening? Okay, we're, we're gonna fix that. Don't worry, don't worry. We're fixing it live, not even post. There we go. Why is it cut off? That's so weird. You're right, you're right. It is cut off. Why? It's the same size monitor as my other one. Listen. <laughs> that's so weird. All right, that's us. I will see you guys, and don't worry, people who are in the stream, I'm not gonna end the stream immediately. I'm gonna end it in a couple minutes after this. But for those of you who are, sorry, those of you who are watching on YouTube, I'll see you guys next time for another exciting Let's Play where I rage at the game while singing its praises some other time. See you guys then.